Chapter 20, The Proof of the Pudding. Mary Kay consultants come from every imaginable background and represent every religion. We attract young women, women in midlife, and grandmothers. They live in large cities and rural towns across the United States and in more than 20 countries on every continent. I wish I could tell you about every one of them because each has a very special story. With all their differences, they share a common bond, a spirit of living and giving that I believe is unique in this business world. When I began this company, I seemed to stand alone in my belief that a business could be predicated on the golden rule. Now the Mary Kay family has shown that women can work and prosper in that spirit while achieving great personal success. For some of our women, success may mean earning enough money to send their children to college or buying a larger home. Others set far higher financial goals. However, they may define success. Mary Kay women agree that their faith and their families come before their careers. They live the Mary Kay philosophy, God first, family second, and career third. Throughout this book, I have told you about many of the consultants and directors who have reached both professional and personal goals. I believe their stories illustrate the real success of Mary Kay Cosmetics. The most valuable assets of our company cannot be found in our balance sheets, for our most important assets are our people. No matter how much profit a company makes, if it doesn't enrich the lives of its people, the company has failed. Our true wealth is measured by thousands of women who have found our company to be the way to live richer, fuller lives for themselves and their families. In my opinion, that's the proof of the pudding. If you read thus far about my life, I know you will agree that mine truly is rags to riches story. I did pull myself up by my bootstraps and build a great company, and I am indeed proud of my life and my legacy. But I'm only one person. Today in the Mary Kay world, there are thousands of women who have achieved great things in their lives thanks to this career. If you want to read the stories of our top people, I strongly urge that you get a copy of a book we published called Room at the Top. It is here you'll find the personal stories of national sales directors pinnacle success of Mary Kay Cosmetics. We call their professional profiles I stories. Reading these I stories is truly motivational and I know for every woman out there there is an I story in the book to which she can relate. It points out to the fact that women can rise to the top of Mary Kay Cosmetics from virtually any position and you'll read in Room at the Top how our national sales directors have done just that. I must say the stories of their lives make fascinating reading. You'll read about one of our national sales directors who had never written a check before her Mary Kay career, and now she earns a lot more than the President of the United States. Another national lived in a subsidized housing. One escaped from communist Cuba, Another couldn't stand the thought of her best friend driving a pink Cadillac. For many couples, the wife's success in Mary Kay allowed the husbands to leave their career that they hated. There's one husband who was an economist. His dream was to open a hair salon. There's another one who was an engineer who later became a minister, and so on. There are inspiring stories of single mothers who were trying hard to support their families in a traditional female job, such as secretaries, nurses, teachers, before they joined the Mary Kay. One very successful national was a single mother working the graveyard shift on an assembly line at a shotgun shell plant prior to finding us. Another left a promising career in television. National sales directors are former models, junior league volunteers, women with advanced degrees, and women who never went to college. One of these women baked key lime pies to supplement her family's income. Another co-founded one of the most successful charitable organizations in Texas. Whether they overcame devastating illness or were stymied by glass ceilings in their chosen professions, 
I think you'll agree that each story has a Cinderella-like quality. Room at the top is the tastiest proof of the pudding I could ever offer you because it proves that the theory is correct, that Mary Kay does work in the lives of all kinds of women. Every age, every background, every race, every color, every creed, these women are absolutely the examples I had in mind for women back in 1963. Reading their stories is most uplifting. I am so proud of all the beautiful, capable women who have made my dream come true. Not only are Mary Kay women the most loyal and dedicated women in the world, they define determination and purpose. They believe that if they work hard enough, and if they give enough of themselves, they will be successful personally and professionally. They find their lives enriched with motivated family, co- close friends, stellar accomplishments, and financial security. And most of all, they understand, as I do, how gratifying it is to be able to help other women achieve their dreams too. Now that you've heard a few of our success stories, I'm sure you can understand why I love my consultants and directors. I'm so proud of all the beautiful, capable women who have made my dream come true. Their success is indeed proof of the pudding. As somebody once said, we're a company that's known for the people we keep, and we think we keep the very best. Mary Kay women are the most loyal and dedicated people in the world. They define determination and purpose. They believe if they work hard enough, if they give enough of themselves, that they will be successful personally and professionally. And at Mary Kay Cosmetics, they find their lives enriched with friends, accomplishments, and financial security.